Welcome to Around the World Channel. Legal fight over Trump's financial records grinds on even as tax details spill out, NPR. President Trump and Vice President Mike Pence make their way to the Rose Garden to speak on COVID-19 testing at the White House Monday. National Coffee Day. How to get free coffee, Fox News. Whether you take your coffee straight or enjoy a packet of sugar, or five, one thing is for sure, the day doesn't start until you've had your cup, and in honor of National Coffee Day on Sept. NASA schedules the first Crew Dragon operational flight for Halloween, and Gadget. The new target date will deconflict the Crew-1 launch and arrival from upcoming Soyuz launch and landing operations. Mars might have salty ponds next to its underground lake, raising the possibility of Martian life, CNN. CNN, two years ago, scientists detected what looked like a salty lake under the surface of Mars' southern ice cap. Dancing with the Stars Disney Night, Carol Baskin scratched after mauling, Lion King, Samba, USA Today. The first night of Dancing with the Stars season 29 was full of tiger stripes and claws. Carol Baskin received the lowest score of the night. Remember what Doc Rivers did and didn't do as Clippers coach, Los Angeles Times. Clippers players didn't want to hear anything Doc Rivers intended to say after TMZ released tapes of racist remarks by then-owner Donald Sterling. Players were mutinous, furious. NYC warns several neighborhoods could be put on strict lockdown today amid troubling COVID surge, Daily Mail. New York City officials have threatened to impose sweeping lockdown measures in several neighborhoods Tuesday amid a deeply concerning surge of coronavirus cases in the Big Apple. Officials at SIT. Coronavirus. Global death toll reaches 1 million. The Independent. The coronavirus pandemic has now claimed more than 1 million lives around the globe, according to the latest official death tolls, with more than 33 million cases. 2020 MLB Bracket Predictions, CBS Sports Staff Picks for Every Postseason Series, CBS Sports. The 2020 Major League Baseball 60-game regular season has come to a close. Although the season was abbreviated, fans will be getting more than usual for this year's MLB postseason.